Selling a company's product or service through relationship referrals has become a common business model in Uganda. The business model has picked up with most companies selling health-related products such as food supplements and medicines from companies like Forever Living, Tianshi, GNLD, and the recent one, Alliance in Motion Global. Under this model, individual distributors who contract to the parent companies are paid a commission based on goods sold through their effort. You keep on referring. If I buy something good and you really admire it, I refer you to where I bought it. In this sense, this time I get commissioned for the service I've done. So that's why most companies, market networking companies, they've gone off media. Dealers in this kind of model cite benefits of building a strong customer base. How the business moves, it is under the company management. So you have nothing to do. I, I'm not supposed to handle the money, but I'm supposed to direct you how to do it. But what is the viability of these products? There is no product. Like in any form, let me say a capsule that comes in the country when it's not satisfied by National Drug Authority. It has to be registered. Then it is also cleared by the Bureau of Standards. And not only that, we have other companies that really are supposed to make these products worth to be consumed by anybody because we have people who are Muslims. So they always want to look at that, what is there, is it halal? Business has taken a different dimension, this time engaging all persons willing to do business, but just like any other company that sells goods or services, the ultimate goal of a network marketing company is to make sales and increase its customer base. Moses Walgembe, UBC News.